Okay, today we are going to make crispy seaweed. So for crispy seaweed, there's actually no seaweed in it at all. But what you need is some sliced curly cow. You also need some Chinese five spice, uh, some brown sugar, some olive oil, a pan, and obviously this is going to be cooked in the oven. So you need to preheat your oven to gas mark six. So what we do first off, you're also going to need a teaspoon and a tablespoon, and obviously a knife. The curly cow is actually sliced already, but I, I, I prefer to slice it down a bit more. And the other thing you want to do is get rid of some of the stalks. So I just cut off the stalks that you don't need, um, and then the other bits of rubbish. But I just try and cut it down a bit, little bit more. Another bit of stalk there. Obviously once you've cut it down, once it's been baked for a while, it obviously shrinks down anyhow, so not too much of a worry. So put it all in the pan. See so bits of stalk like that, you don't want any stalk in it. So cut the stalks off. Right, so I just cut that up. Just nice to cut it down a little bit smaller. Like so, you can break it up with your hands. A bit more on there. The stalk we don't want. Right, that amount there is roughly enough for two. And this is a great thing, just as a little snack. You know, you can make it up, eat it cold, don't have to be eating hot. So, right. Get more in there, have little bits. Right, okay, that's your curly cow cut up. What you do now is you need to get your olive oil and you need a tablespoon of olive oil. One tablespoon. Just pour it over it. Like so. Mix that around with your hands. Just get the oil all over the curly cow. Gets it nice and oiled up. I'm actually using an extra version of it, just ordinary version of um, olive oil would be fine. Okay, so you've mixed it up a bit like that. Right, then what you need is your teaspoon of five, one teaspoon of five spice, Chinese five spice. Sprinkle it over and one teaspoon of a brown sugar. This is a great dish for going with your Chinese. And I actually have it with Indian as well, but whatever. Right, so you just mix that all up. Make sure it's all mixed and coated. Make sure it's all coated. Right, now what you do is you put that in the oven at gas mark six for five minutes. So we'll put that in the oven for five minutes. Okay, right, now what we'll do is spin in the oven for five minutes. We'll take it out of the oven, putting that down so we don't burn the work side.
You can see there, it's starting to crisp up. So we'll give that another little stir around. Stir it all over. I don't know what that is. Odd bit. Another little stir around. Then we'll plonk it back in for another five minutes. So another five minutes and it should be done. Okay, another five minutes have gone. So this should be it now. There we have crispy seaweed. That's lovely. It's all crispy now. And you can you can either eat that hot or you can um, cool it down, eat it cool. It's great with Chinese food or even Indian food or just a little snack on your side, even on the side of your salad. Lovely taste to it. So there we go, crispy seaweed made with curly cow. Enjoy. <laughs>